What's up, sons? It's Blind Rod with Son of a Tech once again, and welcome to yet another Talking Head video. Today, we're going to be taking a look at the official announcement for the release of the London Hard Fork, which includes, of course, EIP 1559. This will impact, of course, investors as well as miners. So, whether you're one or the other, be sure to stay tuned for more details right after a word from our sponsor. Today's sponsor is myself. To support the channel, click the join button below the video and you will get access to our privately hosted Rocket Chat. Selecting the $1.99 option will get you access and after that you need to head over to the membership tab, scroll down, and expand out your membership perks. Find the section for connecting on social media and in that section there will be a secret registration URL to join Rocket Chat where you can sign up to enjoy talking with other cryptocurrency enthusiasts and miners without spammers, scammers, or bots. Welcome back. So if you guys aren't aware, we have London right around the corner and that includes EIP 1559. This has been a hot topic for a long time on this channel as it revolves around the changing of the fee payouts for miners. What essentially is going to be happening is there will be a fee cap and as a part of that fee cap, there will be two portions of the fees that the investors would pay or the traders would pay. One being the tip, which would go to the miners, and one being the base fee which is a changing amount of base fee that will be burned now of course both of those have to basically add up to the fee cap so they can't exceed that fee cap and because the base fee is ever growing it reduces the amount that the traders are able to pay the miners or tip the miners this could of course impact mining revenue pretty significantly initially it was thought that it was going to be around 30 to 40 percent reduction and now it seems to be around 15 to 20 percent reduction due to of course low network activity of course, that low network activity has also pushed back the release of this. Remember, this was supposed to be coming out in late June, early July. Then it got pushed back to mid-July. And now we're looking at, of course, beginning of August, as we reported earlier this week. But we do have confirmation. And that confirmation basically states at this point that... Uh, in here, we'll pull it up for you guys, that it will be on main net block 12,965,000. So that is going to be the timing for the London release. We can kind of figure out, of course, what day that's going to be. They speculate August 4th, but if you wanted to do the math, it's pretty easy to do that. What we have here is the current block which is going to be 12,794,531 and we have the average block time so you can actually do the math yourself and calculate this out yes i did see a couple comments saying you know the block has been confirmed and it's because we have low network activity and all the hash power that's coming off of china is you know the reason why it's delayed not actually true because it hadn't been confirmed as far as what block it was going to be on officially until today so now we have the official information as far as which block is going to convert it so we can do the math out here and so i've actually done it out already and I'll show you guys on my calculator here but what we had to do was take the 12,965,000 and subtract the current amount of blocks which is 12,794,534 once we did that we were able to basically multiply that times 13.66 seconds which is what it was at when I initially was doing it now it's slowed down to a 13.71 second seconds and then that would give us essentially the amount of seconds before it would come into play so at that point we just went ahead and divided by 60 to get the minutes and then divided by 60 again because I'm slow don't worry about it. this is how I do my math to convert it uh, of course to hours and then we div divided it by 24 to come down to the days which comes out to 26.9 days we can round up to 27 days and that is as of or will be from July 9th so if we took a look at a calendar and calculated that out of course I actually don't know how many days that would be how many days are in July let's go ahead and figure this out calendar let's just look at a quick calendar here 
So one, two, three, let's see how many, there's 31 days. So that'd be 28 days. And August 4th would be a little bit beyond that. So it is safe to say that it should come out even possibly before August 4th at the end of July, uh, depending of course, once again, on if these numbers start slowing down as far as the average block times, which even since I made the initial calculation, it has slowed down. Suffice to say, it is looking like it will be end of July to first week of August, somewhere in between there, and we will see that London hard fork take place. Some additional details were covered in the call, specifically regarding the merge. There's a merge checklist. We're gonna be going over that on this channel here this weekend, so make sure you hit the like, comment, subscribe, and notification bell so you're notified when that video is released. Yes, we have some tables to build, and the test bench is gonna be back up this weekend, and we'll probably do a vlog covering that. In addition to that, we also will be taking a look at the official pool protocols for Chia Currency or the Chia Network. So lots of fun stuff coming up on the channel, and I hope to see you guys in the comment section. Thanks once again for watching. I appreciate all the support, and I will see you next Tuesday. If you enjoyed this content, you can watch more by clicking this playlist up here, or go ahead and subscribe.